like you winning too fast. But, ladies and gents, I wanted to move on to this. This was submitted by the illustrious Vivian Van Dam, the, uh, what was it called? The, uh, what's it? Uh, like a, a whimsical name. Ah, the Carrion Queen of the of the High Media Discord. Um, and this, and she sent me this video of uh, of common Ben Shapiro L. Ben Shapiro being a mid human being. Uh, the per the the physical embodiment of. No bitches. Now, I haven't pre-watched this. I'm just saying this because there's nothing that comes out of Ben Shapiro's mouth that's worth listening to. Let's lose brain cells, everybody, together. So Tampax decided to uh, put out one of the most rapey tweets of all time yesterday. Tampax... To, this man, all right, so let's take that quote first of all, which is a bunch of words you never expect to hear together. And it just makes me uncomfortable. Tampax has been celebrated. This is a tampon company. They've been celebrated by the left because... I don't think Ben Shapiro knows what a tampon is. I don't think he knows what their purposes are for. I don't know. I think he, he knows how they are used. I don't think he even understands how they, or, or even how they are... Uh, administered to be expected of course given the man's wife's pussy is as dry as the saharan desert as they have reached out to trans influencers meaning dudes who do not they're not dudes he's being tra he's a transphobic cocksucker have a vagina as uh, as sales mechanisms okay Some trans men need tampons. Some trans women that have had bottom surgery might as well. I hate this man's fucking eyebrows. My God, what a basic skincare routine in, in a facial, say this man, and not the facial he gets from the Coke, Brucker, Coke brothers every weekend to pay for the Daily Wire. Cause, so apparently Dylan Mulvaney reported like a while ago, this would be the, the famous trans person, the, the man who believes that he is a woman who... I got to give him credit. Despite him being very transphobic, he still was able to use the word persons when describing trans people. He's capable of it. He just chooses not to because he's a cocksucker. Interviewed Joe Biden. Dylan Mulvaney said that Tampax had actually approached him about being a sponsor. Tampax US put out a tweet. It said, you're in their DMs. We're in them. We are not the same. I saw that. That was good. That was actually funny. I, that, that, like, I don't know which Gen Zer wrote that for their... Uh, uh, which Gen Zer wrote that on their marketing team? What intern wrote that? But give that person a job and a raise because that shit's funny. That is the most rapey tweet of all time. Oh, <laughs> shut up. Oh, man. This is like like when conservatives law had a conniption over Starbucks cups being red. It's just, it's just You're just making something out of nothing. Ooh, it's just it's just a joke, bruh. Get a sense of fucking humor, Ben. I think. Learn how to eat pussy, Ben. Maybe then you're maybe then you would actually have children that are biologically related to you. I genuinely think that Ben Shapiro has never had sex. I know he's married with two kids, but I genuinely think he has never had sex before. Because because you can you can you can have two kids and be a, lo and a, do a doting husband and father and have never had sex before in your life. Fatherhood and, and husbandry have nothing to do with intercourse. Anyway, everybody collectively point at this man and laugh. He is a he is he is a blight of he is a he is a box 
among mankind.